I am working on the top bars now. I'm gonna lay some string down and put some wax on top of it. And I saw this on YouTube and I don't remember the guy's name. If I find it, I'll put a link. But uh, basically just trying to center this up. This is my brood, my brood bar. And I'm just taking a soldering iron and some wax foundation. I'm just going to drip it right on the string there. And you want to use a uh, natural string. Don't use any nylon style string. This would be wax foundation. And this will encourage the bees to start drawing out their cones right off the top of this. And it's pretty much the completed top bar hive out of pallets. I am going to end up actually putting a landing on the bottom here and a uh, little bit of an awning. And I do want to do a little bit more trim around these sides just to keep anything else from getting inside it um, in the top bar part. But uh, it's turned out really well. Fasten the hood to where I can just use a chain, or it works pretty good like this. I don't know. We'll figure that out. But I'm ready for my bees. I'm gonna go tomorrow. I'm setting up a trap on a hive on a honey tree, and we'll see how that goes. And I'll let you tag along with me on that one as well. So here we have finished top bar hive now I gotta figure out exactly what location I'm gonna put this in right now it's right beside the house and I actually I'm going to fence it in with some of this light vinyl sheeting fencing area and fence it in here and have a smaller fence over on this side here and so it allow the bees travel point but I'm not real sure if I want to keep it this close to the side of the house so still trying to play with the, the area of where it's going to go right now keep it sharp Mr. Razor out